Yeah, no kidding, warning health and safety. That is an extremely appropriate label to put in front of this game. Hey there, everyone, this is Algal playing Sonic the Hedgehog Genesis for the last time. Let's just. Let's just. Let's just under, I mean, we're at the last boss. We're at the final zone place over here. Final, they call it. Cause it's the final zone, it's that song playing, it's pretty okay. That's right, you oh, it's Robotnik and his wacky Silender. Oh right, this. Uh, how's this gonna go? Badly? Yeah. Probably. Okay, so you just don't... Hmm, I guess you gotta hold up, maybe, to have an idea of... Like, the cylinders, which ones are gonna move? I don't know. Alright, look at that. You just kinda hug the cylinder, and then you're good. Then you find out which orb has room between its sparks. Like, yeah, like, like, I, I, you cannot tell which cylinders are gonna move, though. Oh my gosh, how can you just not play the game, apparently? Like, you just need to play the game that you've made to see that there's a problem here. But not even that. <sighs> okay. Alright. Like, you just need to hold up like that, but like, I don't know. No, you can't even see! I couldn't even see the top floor! The, the, the roof. You, you, you need to jump! What is this? Oh boy, this feels... So much worse than I could have even imagined. Do I need to just hang out here and hope for the best? I can do that. Yeah, maybe I'll just do that. It'll take a while, and it'll suck, but... I won't be ambushed? Okay. Degenerate strategies. Here we go. And there the placement was bad. Game over. Fart, fart, fart. Game over. That's a fun sound. What? Safe here. <laughs> this is this just turned real sad. I mean, I'm gambling anyways on being somewhere I can hit that column Robotnik lives inside, so. Okay. This is what I'm doing now. I mean, you know, broken is broken. But if you can be broken in a way that makes it real easy for me, I'll take it. This is just sad, though. Alright, I'm gonna cut this up into meat stripes, because there's no point in showing absolutely every step. Whoa, I got a hidden. Yeah, snuck in a hit. Hey, that guy is right next to me. He wants to say hello. Get in here. The game has a timer, so you know how much time happened, roughly, between hits. Hey, it's Robotnik! Whoa, my favorite Jim Carrey character! 
Hedgehog outsmarts 300 IQ scientists tonight on Six Ad World. There you go. Destruction. I'm gonna keep destroying you. That's what I do now. Just complete assault on this tomato man, and it's saving. What a sad ending. What a s oh dear snow. Sandpaper brain. Oh. I mean, a sad last boss for a sad video game. I mean, the game was hard in a frustrating way. This was just, like, completely busted. At least it was free. I mean, I'll take it, I guess. And apparently the credit is just the credit of the original game. We don't even get, like, the credit of the people who work on this port. Which I wonder if is on purpose. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if everyone involved with Sonic the Hedgehog Genesis kind of willfully Alan Smithied themselves out of this. I think I would. And now, for everyone's favorite section of every one of my videos, it's Cow Cow's Consumer Report Corner. So, should you buy Sonic the Hedgehog Genesis for the Game Boy Advance? No! No, you should not. To purchase this game is an amoral act and will send you to prison. There are two people who are allowed to play it to buy this game. Confused family members, like that Sonic pushing against the wall for no reason. And uh, collectors, like there are people out there who just want to collect every Sonic game or every GBA game. Like, as long as you're buying the game in order to fill in a hole, and you don't ever intend on actually playing it, then okay. It is a legal purchase. You're good. Ugh. What a nightmare this has been. Look at that, you kinda like got stuck in a corner there. What an idiot. Instruments are missing. It's pretty rad. It's my favorite part, too. So, uh, backgrounds look broken and glitchy. It's probably on purpose. I... I think this is the bottom of the barrel. I think I've hit it. People were right that the bottom barrel was in 2006. They didn't know how, though. They might have missed on the aim of the game, but this is it. I doubt I will ever have as little fun as I've had this week. But look at this man's juggling act, though. It's pretty darn gosh good. Um, as a final act of this game, I was requested to try to play through, like, a level with music and sound effect off. And apparently we're in for a surprise. Sure, why not? I'll use this opportunity to tease what we're going to be doing next time. You know, there's two Sonic the Hedgehog game. Oh, look at that, we open a jukebox, can listen to Butchered Ports, yeah! Sound effects, too. It's... wait. I go here, and then it goes here? Why does it just warp? It won't let me play it. That's pretty good. Totally not broken. Maybe it's just something I don't understand. Why not? Turn everything off. Yeah, beautiful. Alright, let's, let's go. Let's just go. Coming up next, after both Sonic the Hedgehog releases, another game was released like two days later. Except I've never played it. Wow, this plays significantly better. This is surreal. What? This plays so much. I cannot explain it. I cannot... What? Why? It's the sound engine that broke the game? Okay, then. Yeah, coming up next, released two days later, there's a third game release for the Sonic the Hedgehog 15th anniversary, and I don't know anything about it. That's not true. There's one thing I know about it, and it's that for the longest time, it was thought that because it was programmed using evil magic, it was impossible to emulate. But because of all the Sonic series is blessed by the heavens, apparently, that was solved in, in 2019 at some point. A little bit, like, after the all the Sonic series started. Dude, this is playable. Like, I am not exaggerating. I mean, that play bad, like, that did not feel right. But the level itself... 
was felt like sighing the hedgehog. I. Uh, okay. Don't ask. It's fine. You can go to sleep. If you want to play Sonic the Hedgehog in 2021, there's like a billion options for you, most of them legal. And even in 2006, I bet there was like five ways you could play Sonic the Hedgehog, the first one. Maybe not portably though. Because it's true that if you compare this to like the Java phone ports, like this is significantly superior, but it's still not good. Get your Sega Nomad and destroy some batteries instead.